Anyway, if she doesn't return and it's complete refusal and complete disobedience, so how should we behave? We say that the next step after trying to admonish her is to be distanced from her. And how does he be distanced from her? And that is for Naam. three days he refuses to speak to her and then after three days he greets her. And also in terms of sleeping, he also and he stays away from her. And this means that he can sleep in the same bed but gives her his back. So he doesn't need to go and sleep on the couch in a different room. Now if she's sorrowful and regretful and she repents, again the file is closed. But if she carries on with her disobedience and a complete refusal, some people think that Islam, it calls to beating the women and leaving marks on them. And Islam is free from this. The Prophet Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam, he never hit a slave or a servant, never mind a woman. It's not possible. It's not possible that the religion of Islam contains an encouragement to beat or hurt women and leave marks upon them. And here is in front of you the seerah of the Prophet Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam and the lives of the Sahaba. And then after this stage, he does not hit a woman and leave marks on her.